Hey guys, Trucker G here again. Uh, if you ain't done so already, please hit, hit that subscribe button and like like the videos. Check out some of my other videos. Help me out. And you, all, you can also catch me on Facebook at Trucker G. If you got any comments or questions, by all means, I'm accessible all the time. Just hit me up and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, today, let's talk about maintaining a healthy relationship and, and what, while you're out here on the road or just in life life in general while you're being while you're a trucker. I mean, it's not it's not a cakewalk, guys. The divorce rate in trucking is astronomical. I mean, if I had to guess, I would say it's probably eighty percent or better. I'm sure half of you uh, either either already know that or seen it on the internet, and I won't lie to you, it's it's huge. But there's a few tricks that you can use to help your relationship out. What I do, and my wife does, we try to never never hang up the phone mad at each other. You know, if you hang up the phone mad, usually, I, I know with me, if I hang up the, the phone mad, well, I just get madder and madder. I've got to resolve the issue. I cannot stand something unresolved. You know, another thing that we do is when I go home, and this is why you haven't seen a video from me in a little while, I try to do nothing, to, I, I try to have nothing to do with trucking. You know, if I have to take my truck to the shop, I'll drop it off to the shop real quick, and I'll come pick it up when it's done, and that's the gist of that. You know, the wife, she cleans my truck out for me. God bless her. <laughs> um, but after she gets done with that, we don't talk nothing about trucking. I mean, she don't sit there and tell me how big of a pig I am or anything. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, those are the, the those are the two biggest things. I mean, when you're home, make home time your home time. If you're sitting there talking about trucking or talking about work or thinking about work, well, you're not getting a good... You're not getting a good home time. You're not getting good rest. And I'm sure that's the last thing she wants to hear is about trucking. She wants to hear about her and, and you and, you know, family, family stuff. I know me, I got in, into trucking for my family. So, you know, those are just tips that you can use to make life a little better. I'm not saying it's going to work for you. It's worked for me and... I've been married for just as long as I've been trucking, 28 years. Actually, I've been married a long, a long oh, well, a little bit longer than, than I've been trucking. But that's beside the point. But it's worked for me. So, hopefully it'll work for you. Well, as usual, I'm going to keep this short, guys. And y'all be safe out there.